uh, super missiles. <laughs> it's so easy, but it is hard as shit when you do 1% items. I'm not gonna lie, it is really hard. But, technically, this boss on hard mode is pretty hard. I mean, you don't have as much super missiles. You don't have a lot of missiles either. So, it, it does get a little hard. Didn't want that. There we go. But, yeah, um... I'm good at the game, so it's pretty easy for me. I mean, kind of, I guess, any difficulty. Except for the 1% one. Killing Ridley... Five or did you have to get another one? Or like five to ten missiles, no energy tanks. It's hard. It's extremely hard. Because you know, like one or two, one or two attacks, you're done. It's over. And as you plainly saw in the battle, I got hurt a few times, so I would have died. Yeah, it's pretty uh, intense, yo. Thank you, Buggy. Oh, God. Thank you, Buggy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Don't make this a repeat. Repeating. It's always the freaking enemies you have to freeze. Are you, are you kidding me? I don't have time for this. I don't have time for that. <laughs> I don't have time for it. Bomb jump my way up. See, I'm pressing down, but it doesn't go down. That's weird. So I have to actually aim down before I press S. Quite strange on the simulator. Visual Blade Vance. So, you know, one everyone uses. Eh, okay, good enough. Now I have defeated Kraid. I have defeated Ridley. There's only one more boss to get. To rape. Rape is not. Unless you make a joke about it. It's hilarious. See, I'm not supposed to have a screw attack. Oh my god. Okay. There's also this path. If you don't have a screw attack, you could go through here. It's awesome. See? What you're supposed to do is run through this pathway. With the, with the uh, speed booster. And you're just going through. Now, if you can see... The room... It says create area on the left, first green one right here where the Chozo symbol is near the map area. That's where you got the screw attack, and you're supposed to use that little cannon where I am to go up to that room and go left. But I already got the screw attack, so I don't need to do that. I don't need to go over there. So what I should do is go back and take that little shortcut. You can either go back up here use the one down there, and I actually feel like using the one down there, because I don't know. You don't, you don't know me. You don't know what I do. Either way, it's off to see the mother brain of Oz. God damn it, I keep forgetting. Jesus Christ. That was, that was my alarm that went off for no reason at all. Thanks, clock. Talking clock. It's 1 a.m. <laughs> Jeez, scared the crap out of me. Oh, my God. I don't even know if you heard that on the mic. This mic is pretty uh, good. I know I can't really hear any background noises. Except for a little static you can probably hear. But other than that, it's fine. On the way. On the way to mother brain. Gonna suck the fluids out of her brain. I'm just gonna shut up until I get there.
thought I was kidding. I shut. I just shut myself up. Oh God! Look at them, Metroids, sucking the life out of that poor space pirate. Oh no! Oh God! What's he? What's he gonna do? Oh! Oh God! Jesus! Oh, it's like a jump scare. Oh my God! That scared me. That scared me, dude. Look at these dead bodies. Anyway, here we go. Metroids. The last level. Oops. Oops. Yeah, this is a good start. My emulator controls. But yeah. Freeze them. Shoot them five times. The missile. Those freaking Cheerios of death. Ugh. And by the way, I... I Hey, I understand the Game Grumps pain. While I was playing without talking, I was doing significantly better. Because, like, he, you know, Aaron's right. Like, when you're talking, you can't really focus on the game itself because, you're, you know, you're trying to either please the audience or just, you know, talk with your partner. Like, like John or Ross or Danny or even Barry now and Susie. Like, you can't exactly focus on the game. But you still can, it's just you can't focus on it as much, I guess. Can you stop sucking my everything, please? I'm trying to have a polite conversation with my loyal audience. Oh yeah, speaking of audience. I got a... Oh, I suck. I suck more than... Uh, a few days ago I had like 64 subscribers, and now I have 71 today. I was like, what the hell? What the freak is happening? Is my crap that good? That's what I asked myself. Yes, it is. I guess my stuff, my good stuff is worthy. My stuff is good and worthy for, uh, view sh viewing. Viewership. The views of viewing. But yeah, I remember, uh, when I had, when I created these YouTube account back in 2008, I had no subscribers, obviously. Although I did create few Lego stop motion videos, if you haven't seen them. And that was back in like 2009. I made the videos in 2008, but I uploaded them in 2009. Then after that, I really st stopped doing things until I found out about TF2 in 2011. And I started making a little, some videos there. Uh, you know, they weren't good quality because I didn't exactly know how to make replays at that point. You there. Oh. Oh no. This isn't good. Okay. 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 You want some? Yeah. Suck me. Yeah. See what I care. Suck me. Yeah. See what happens to people who suck me? Stupid. What was I saying? These stupid TF2 videos in 2011 that were stupid, and then I waited like a million years until 2013. I finally actually tried again to make TF2 videos. And they were successful, you know? I made put music in them, and that's. I had like seven subscribers at that point. They were just my friends, though. And then, as soon as I could make more videos, more subsplurbers came. And... I guess here I am. <laughs> Usually post videos monthly, like the replay ones. I could post more often. I could. But yeah. I make these videos just for the fun of it, you know? Yeah, they are fun! It's, I love making replay videos. They're so fun. Especially syncing the music. Usually, when I make replay videos, I just wing it. Like, I, like I just edit it once when I'm in the, in the game. And then I just think the first song that pops into my head when I make a replay video. And it works. And I'm not gonna lie, it worked. It, it, it synced pretty well with, um... My staring, was it? Yeah, the staring contest of Death One. That one is my favorite one. It is the best. I did plan a little bit in that one. That's because I found the right music for it. 
I have everything. What am I doing? And, uh, yeah, it's just, I love it. I love making those videos, and I love planning them sometimes, too. But I normally just wing it. I just do it. And, and usually, the, uh, most of the time, they match. The music matches pretty good, pretty well. And I was going to say before, since it's an emulator and I'm on full screen right now, it's pretty hard to tell, like, when Metroids are unfreezing because they're not flashing. That's why I kept sucking at that part. Now it's time for the brain of mothers. I have been talking my ass off. I didn't mean to do that. Oh! Oh! You know, I never liked this battle. But I did like the fact that the Mother Brain actually attacks you now. You know, instead of, like, in the original one. It's just the freaking enemies. Jeez, man. Did I miss an energy tank? Oh, I thought, oh, I thought that was it. I thought you were done for. Go, 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 Speed booster, speed Go, 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 go. Ah, dang, it didn't work. Oh, whatever. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. The place is gonna explode, like, in every single Metro game ever, except for the second one. Ah! Ah! In hard mode, uh, you only have one minute to get out of here. Yeah. It's pretty insane. The place is going to blow up. We need to get out of here. Hurry up, 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 hurry up. Anyway, um If you don't have the high jump, no, if you it's actually it is possible to skip the speed booster, but if you don't have it, you can't get through there. So you can actually go up here. It's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, you, yeah, you can't can skip this speed booster, I think. I mean, because why would they put that, that, uh, that thing up there? Or the hallway? Doesn't matter, I'm out. Screw you all. I'm done. Oh, man. It feels nice to just escape, you know? Let the whole Torian area blow up. gonna take my clothes off because I feel confident about my body. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> go, Samus, go. go! Go, 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 dodge the lasers! Yes, 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 yes. Man, Samus. That was a close call. You know, it'd be a shame if you just got hit by a random laser coming from... Oh man, when I first played that part, me and my friend Austin, we were like, What the hell? This wasn't part of the first game? Because we... <laughs> it was amazing. The timing of my escape couldn't, been, couldn't have been worse. I was attacked by space pirates and left nearly defenseless. Stripped of... Stripped of my power suit, all I had for protection was my rather useless emergency pistol. The rain is decreasing the frame rate. Infiltrating the space pirate mothership so armed may have been foolish, but I had no choice. And I remember, we reacted. That ass. Could I survive long enough to escape? I don't know. The frame rate went down from the rain, so I'm very scared right now. Alright. We started. My suit's gone. What do I have to lose? Nothing? No. I need to get my suit back. It's the only way. It's time. To be stealthy! This is the best part of the whole game. I remember. It's just amazing. Oh man. I love it. 
This is a big area, by the way. Yeah. Okay, this time I actually... I will say, I mean, it's necessary. I guess. Why not? Hey, don't look at me like that. Saving is for pussies. Well, guess what? I'm a pussy. I am a pussycat. Yeah, that's right. You heard me. It's heck.